So Sarah, what are the things you're most excited about the Arkansas Bar Association's annual meeting? So I am super excited that so much awesome CLE is being offered. Did you know there's over 36 hours of CLE and that includes six ethics hours? Um, it's gonna be an awesome opportunity to get a lot of CLE. I am so excited about our opening plenary speaker, um, Stacy Leeds. Um, admittedly, I'm also really excited about the Wednesday evening uh, virtual chocolate tasting experience. Did you read about that? I did. So am I actually going to get a box of chocolates that I can eat by myself and hide from my daughter? Absolutely. And I would recommend it. So when you register for annual meeting, um, once you are signed up, the association will know to send you um, a box of chocolates. I think the hardest part of this is going to be setting it aside and waiting for the chocolate tasting event. Um, but Dorothy Cox Chocolates will be with us on Wednesday evening um, and will lead um, an actual chocolate tasting um, experience so that we can learn about um, how they're made, what it is that, that, that we're eating, um, and most importantly, just enjoy some chocolates. Um, so Thursday night, what are you going to be doing? I will be watching the Hamilton at Home um, Broadway event from 6 to 7 on Thursday, June 17th. That's what I'm most excited about. It doesn't take the place, of course, of the firm party, but I'm so excited that we get to listen to the stars of Hamilton. And I have to tell you, um, I don't know if it's official an official endorsement. I have a, uh, RBG here and I think that she would be most excited about the live Lady Justice podcast. I am such a podcast person, so I'm very excited about Lady Justice as it's one of my favorite podcasts. And did you know that our own Supreme Court Justice, Rhonda Wood, is one of the founding members of the podcast? And she's bringing three of her Supreme friends with her, Chief Justice Brenda McCormick, Justice Eva Guzman, and Justice Beth Walker. So it's going to be a great time to hear them talk. And it will be, I think, the first time that they've been together since the season began. So it'll be really fun to, to see them all play together and listen to what they're bringing to us at the Bar Association. Jamie, I'm so excited about another plenary speaker, Isaac Wright Jr., um, have you seen TV advertisements for um, that ABC, ABC TV show called For Life? I have, and I understand that it's actually based on his real life story of being wrongfully accused and wrongfully convicted. Is that right? Absolutely. And he became an attorney. Um, and he has just had the most incredible journey. And I think it's going to be um, so great for members of the association to get to hear from him on Friday. Well, I, I'm very excited about that. I think there's some lessons that we all need to hear from him um, and really look at what he has to say about diversity and inclusion in the judicial system, as well as in the legal profession and how that impacts wrongful convictions and what we can do as members of the Bar Association to help ensure things like that don't happen again. Now, what about, this all seems uh, really deep. Um, we're talking about some, some hard to talk about topics in the law. Um, what about some fun? Are we gonna have some fun too? Every day of annual meeting, we're starting with yoga. Uh, to get our minds right, get our bodies moving a little bit um, before, you know, days in front of the computer, which honestly, um, you know, isn't so different than a lot of our days. And Friday after yoga, you can finish it off with the laughs from our attorney ethics game show, ethical observations from a courtroom comedian for Joe Ulster is going to come give us some ethics, but maybe in a way that we haven't heard before. I think it's awesome that we're going to get to hear from a lawyer comedian um, because really 
the only time that lawyers and the practice of law are associated with comedy is that lawyers are frequently the butt of every joke. And so I am excited uh, to hear from a lawyer comedian. Um, we'll add some levity, I think, to the meeting. And I'm also excited to hear from a lawyer out of Seattle who's going to come talk to us about a balanced work life as we've as we've kind of seen out of COVID and coming out with all of these virtual work from homes, um, what it means to have a balanced work life. So I think that will be a, a good ethical consideration for us. So, Absolutely. and Jennifer Donaldson, uh, the director of Arkansas JLAP uh, will be presenting to us as well um, about these, um, you know, the work-life balance dynamic um, and, and especially, um, the, the stresses uh, that sort of rose to the surface um, due to COVID. And she is a dynamic and charismatic, phenomenal speaker. So I can't wait to hear from Jennifer as well. Well, there's just so much going on at the Arkansas Bar Association's annual meeting that's going to take place Tuesday, June 15th through Friday, June 18th. Sarah, with all this excitement surrounding it, how do I sign up? 